when I go to my channel and here we'll be working on this building drawing uh, problem and this is the sketch plan as you can see here and here in the uh, instruction so we are told that we figure to shows a sketch plan of a bungalow study the sketch plan with the given specifications and answer the questions that follow so as I said this is the sketch plan as you can see here and specifications we have it here at the back here and um, so as we have here so the foundation is given the floor the wall the lintel beams column doors windows roof and then here we are told to draw to a scale of 1 ratio 100 Roma figure 1 floor plan Roma figure 2 front elevation and question B says that we are to draw to a scale of 1 ratio 50 the detailed view of the section on YY so we are going to answer the question one by one so we are starting with the floor plan uh, as part one of this uh, work okay and the scale that we have to use is 1 ratio 100 so we want to work on the floor plan okay now on the floor plan uh, based on what we have here in the floor plan uh, we have the uh, windows being fixed in the walls and then we also have the doors being fixed within the wall so those are the two things that we need apart from the thickness of the wall so the wall as we have here that uh, all walls 225 with 12 motor rendering on both sides that's what the question says so what we need to do first is to replicate what we see here all these lines this line here and this line so with everything that we have here so this line stands for the exterior part of the wall it stands for the stand for the exterior part of the wall so we just need to replicate what we see here so we are going to do it together so this stands from year to year is 4400 we are going to divide each dimension by 100 so let's see so what we need to do first here is to um to draw a horizontal line like this and then so we are going to draw a vertical line so we need to take our time to do this i want us to do it together so we we'll draw a vertical line like this then the next thing that we need to do is to take a measurement of 4400 but we are going to divide that by 100 and that will give us 44 so we take a measurement of 44 millimeters so this is uh, from this point so you take 44 millimeters this is 44 millimeters here so the next one is 34 millimeters because uh, the distance uh, the uh, dimension is 34 is 3400 so we take 34 millimeters so this is 34 millimeters here so the next one is 2400 so we take 24 millimeters so this is 24 millimeters then last one is 3600 so we are going to take 36 millimeters 36 millimeters okay so this is 36 millimeters so we draw a vertical line here here we draw a vertical line so when you are doing this so you have to use a uh, thin continuous line first so then the next one on the width side here on the width side here we have from year to year is 6400 and this is 2400 from year to year and from year to year 6400 so that means i'm coming on this side so i'm going to take a measurement of 64 millimeters after i divide the 6400 by 100 this is 64 millimeters okay so next one is 24 millimeters okay all right so i have this okay so also i uh, will need to come to this side here because the way uh, this part is structured is different from the way this part is structured so we are going to uh, follow the dimensions here this is 36 from year to year 
this six from year to year and this is one two from year to year one two from year to year and also three six from year to year so let's take that measurement so we come to this side so i'll be taking 36 millimeters 36 millimeters um, okay all right so 36 so that's six so this is one two three so this is 36 millimeters here okay then the next one is uh 120 so one uh, sorry 1200 so that would be 12 millimeters so from this point here i will take a measurement of 12 millimeters 12 millimeters then i will take another 12 millimeters from here another 12 millimeters so this is 12 millimeters so the last one i will take is 36 millimeters 6 millimeters so this is it all right so we have that dimension so and next thing i'm going to do now is that uh, based on what we are given here based on what we are given here so i first of all draw this line then uh, i will still need to come to this side here to draw but uh, let's draw this line so let's draw this line then we need to work on this part so um so this is how it goes okay so here i will draw a line and then come here i will draw a vertical line here okay then here i'm going to draw this horizontal line so draw horizontal line here okay so then based on what we have there so i will draw horizontal line here like this okay all right so um then i need to come here and draw horizontal line like this okay so then also, I need to draw horizontal line. So from here, I will draw horizontal line. And here also, I will draw horizontal line from here to here. And then here, I will draw horizontal line. Okay. So then, uh, coming to this part here, as we have here. So, um okay so what we have here we have to bring out this kitchen here so this kitchen here we have to bring it out and they said distance from year to year is 2000 from year to year is 2000 so i need to uh, first of all so there is a point that i have here so i need to draw that's for the dining room so i need to draw this line and i'm going to take 20 millimeters from this end here so this is 20 to get that kitchen so this is 20 so i will draw a horizontal line here like this and then um so what else do we have here so what else do we have so okay so coming to this part here so this bedroom here so this line and this line they are together so i need to extend this line okay so this line okay so that's it so then um so coming on this part here so we need to take the measurement that we have here so for the toilet for the lobby and also for the bedroom here and then we also have uh, this water closet here in the uh, in the bedroom so we need to bring out this part so i need to so i'm going to get the toilet so they said distance from year to year is one four and from year to year is three thousand and from year to year is 2000 from here to here is one eight 
and from year to year is 2000 so i need to take those measurements so i uh, come in here first to get the toilet so i will take 14 millimeters so this is 14 millimeters so the rest from here should be so this is 3000 so that one has come out so then i need to take um so i need to draw this line from here so that we'll be able to draw the water uh, closest in the uh, in the bedroom so i will take 2000 from here on this line so this is 2000 okay so then um then from here i will need to take 2000 from here okay so this line so i'll just take this up here okay and this one so i'm going to that is for the water closet and here i need to draw this as a vertical line for the toilet all right so if you look at all that we have here everything has been put in place so as we have here everything has been put in place this living room is here this dining room is here so the kitchen is what we have here the bedroom we have it here so water closet here we have it here the other one we have it here and then bedroom is here then we have what we have this bedroom so we have it here lobby is here and this toilet is here so everything has been put in place so what we need to do now is go to go to, for the thickness of the wall okay for the thickness of the wall so we have to go back to the um specifications so for the walls we have all walls to 25 with 12 motor rendering <coughs> on both sides so um so we have to 25 so we are going to have 12 plus 12 that's 24 so 24 plus 225 that give us um to uh 49 to 49 by 100 that give us 2.49 so 2.49 so i will just uh okay so that means the thickness of the wall is two millimeters so what you need to do now is that so you come here so this external was so you take two millimeters inward two millimeters inward this is two millimeters and here also you come here you take two millimeters inward this is two millimeters so then you join this together so join this together just look at how i'm going to do it so you join this together like this so we have taken that particular wall now for this one so take two millimeters here and then you come here you take two millimeters so we have to take our time to get this done so you cannot rush this so this is two millimeters so you join this together with a straight line like this and then come in here so let's take it to this side so apart from this one we cannot take it outside we can only take it inside but this one can be taken either of the two sides so now for this one i like to take it to this side this is two millimeters then here we also have two millimeters and we join this together okay then so coming here We also have a wall here. We have a small um, uh, for this one here. Should have taken it to this side. Uh, okay, what I will just do. So, also this uh, small wall here, you also take two millimeters from here, and then 
So we come up here, we take two millimeters. So we make this a thick line, or make draw the line. Okay. Then so I come here. So I take two millimeters to this side. Oh, let me take it to this side. So this wall and this wall they are not on the same line. So you take note of that. Okay, so I will draw this line. Also, so here we take two millimeters. Then So don't forget that what we are doing is that we are bringing out the thickness of the wall. That's what we are doing here now. So then, so for this wall here, so you take two millimeters here, and then coming up here, take two millimeters. Okay, so here also I will take two millimeters inward and here I take two millimeters and I will join this together. Okay, so then so that is for the all the vertical so let's look at it for all the vertical so for the horizontal so i have so take two millimeters from here inward okay so here i will take two millimeters Here, and also draw from here to here. Okay, so then for this, I will also take two millimeters. So we have to take our time to do this. So we take two millimeters here, and here we take two millimeters. So then we draw. Okay. So then for this, we are going to take two millimeters. Take two millimeters. And for this, so here we take two millimeters in watch. And here we take two millimeters from here. So we are almost done. So here we take two millimeters. Inward. And here we take two millimeters. Inward. And we join this together. Okay. So then this we are going to take two millimeters then 
come here so you take two millimeters in here and you want to take two millimeters so you join this together all right so that's the thickness we have taken all the walls i have taken all the walls so let's meet on the fixing of windows and doors thank you